just your average tour at United Nations headquarters in New York City. Checking out the General Assembly Hall, posing for pictures, and let's face it, wondering if snack time is soon. I wish it were lunch time. Except these visitors are, well, just a little smaller than usual. This group of children, one of the first to take a brand new United Nations tour, one that's uniquely tailored to a child's perspective. Complete with stickers, activity books and quizzes, the new tour explains the core values and missions of the UN to children in a fun and interactive way. And it doesn't get much more interactive than being addressed by Secretary General Ban Ki-moon himself, who spoke to children at the tour's launch. I see from all of you the future leaders of uh, tomorrow. You may become a scientist, a politician, actors or actresses, diplomats, uh, business uh, persons, musicians. So whole world is yours now. And the world is indeed waiting for nine-year-old third grader and aspiring fashion designer Sophie Patrick, who asked the Secretary General for his autograph before trying out the tour for size. Are you going to tell your friends about what you did today? Yeah. What are you going to say to them? Um, I met the, um, one um, very important person and um, that um, I went on a tour and I learned lots of different kinds of things. This object is called Escopetarra. Escopetarra. Very good. Escopetarra. It's the children's excitement and wonder that makes such a difference between adult and kids' tours, says tour guide and Khalid Waldemaiko. When I see these children, I just see them the future of tomorrow. So it's like giving them that special attention and make sure that they know and they understand. Because they don't forget. Adults come with an opinion already. So it's to be able to move them, that's the one number one difference. And of course, crowd control. <laughs> tour guide Karen Orantis has been working on developing the kids' tour for the past 18 months. She says that though making the tour fun is paramount, something much bigger is also at play. A lot of people come back later on and say, you know, when I was six, seven, eight years old, I took a tour of the United Nations, and that's still the impression I have of the United Nations today. So we really want to lay this groundwork and the foundation for empowering the kids of having this positive image of the United Nations and also the idea that they themselves can make the world a better place. Tours for any secretary generals in training that you might know cost $9 and will run Thursday afternoons. You can always find the latest information on times and tours by visiting visit.un.org. This is Alexandra King for United Nations Television.